everyone and welcome to Learn Tech. This tool that I will introduce to you guys today converts your old DVDs to MP4 in minutes and they are giving away full licenses for free. Let me show you how to grab yours and how fast it works. So basically what you have to do, you just click on the link on the description below and then you will come on this page where you can get two licenses for those two tools, which are WinX DVD Reaper and WinX Video AI. You need the WinX Video AI in order to upscale your DVD videos to 4K, for example. And I have done another video for that and you find the description on below how to use WinX Video AI in order to upscale your video qualities. In this video, we're gonna focus on WinX DVD Reaper and in order to download the tool, you can just click on the link on the description below and you will come on the main page and to get the license code, you click on the get license code from this giveaway. So to install WinX DVD Reaper, it's quite basic. You just click next, 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 and then you'll come on this page. And then what you have to do, you have to specify if you have an image or an ISO file, which you wanna rip or backup or whatsoever if you wanna load from a folder or whatsoever. I'm gonna go directly to the DVD. So I'm using an external DVD player and it's not very practical because actually the new computers not always have DVD players and that's why I wanna convert all my DVDs to MP4 so I have those on my computer. I'm just using this DVD which I have for my kids. So basically you just choose the DVD disc and then you choose auto detect or force UDF or force ISO. I'm just choosing auto detect and then the DVD disc file system will just find which file system I'm using. And then I press over OK and then it will load all the files from my DVD. So here we are, the output profile. General profiles are here. You can check what exactly there are many different profiles that you can use but I'm gonna go and focus mainly for mp4 video which will be my case but you can play around for the other options if you want to convert to iPhone, iPad, Android or whatsoever. I'm just gonna go with the mp4 video which is recommended actually for converting or backing up those DVD files to MP4 uh, multimedia format and the resolution will keep the original. So I'm gonna choose the first one, MP4 video, and then I'll click over OK. And here you have the list of all the files that you have on the DVD. I'm gonna select, let's say this one, which is title 18. You can choose also many more, so you can select at the same time many more videos that you have on the DVD. But I'm just gonna select for this one, which actually is detected as the main title. And then you can click over edit here and you can have more information about this video, like crop and expand, trim or whatsoever. I'm just not gonna go to that direction in this video. And once you have selected the title or the video that you wanna export, you basically, you just have to choose on the right then hardware acceleration. In this case, I'm gonna apply Intel or Nvidia. This is the default, so it will use any one of those that you have on your computer. You can also choose use high quality engine with you have different kind of engines or whatsoever, you can choose this option. So after you have selected all the settings over here, another important setting is the destination folder over here. You can change it. So by clicking over browse, you can define where you wanna save this file. I'm just gonna leave the default one, which is in this case, this one. And once you are done, you just click over run. So basically the, this process of ripping this DVD, it will take some time. So it has started, let's say the start time and the end time, but also it depends a lot how big is the file. I'm not gonna leave you guys waiting on this video. So we meet at the end when this process is over. Uh, so after you have waited till the end, when the whole process is done, then you just click over destination folder here at open, and then you will be redirected to this page or to this folder where you can see the folders or the files that you have exported. So here it is, for example, mine that I just exported. I'm just gonna mute this feature so I don't have any copyright issues at the end. So basically this is how it is. The video quality is quite good. I have checked it, it's really nice. And basically that's it. So that's how you can rip or backup your DVD files to MP4 or whatsoever. I hope you find this video useful and please leave a the comments below. Did you like this tool? And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Wish you all the best. Thank you.